good morning student welcome to the another session of our study program today our topic is flower as we know flower is the most beautiful part of a plant so we can define flower as flower is a specialized shoot in which the leaves are modified into floral structure this is the typical flower we can divide it into uh, four parts first part is calyx corolla androecium and finally gynecium so the, we can say this is sepal if you will talk it combinedly it is known as calyx this reason is sepal this green part is sepal and uh, as you can see in uh, diagram this is the thalamus thalamus is also known as receptacles and this is the stalk this stalk is attached with a twig this stalk is also known as pedicle so first part so we can divide the flower in four part and each part is known as whorl this is calyx and uh, calyx it is commonly known as calyx and this is the sepal sepal is of green color in some cases it may be non green and uh, petal this is the colorful part of the flower you can see in diagram this is commonly known as corolla and the third hole of a flower is uh, androecium androecium is considered as the male part of the flower so it is also known as stamen the symbol of male part is like this and uh, you can see in diagram this is anther and uh, this one is filament and if you will talk about the four hole of a flower this is known as gynecium it is also known as pistil and pistil is symbolized with this symbol if you will consider the different parts associated with the gynecium you can see this is at the top it is stamen this long part is style and ovary is the at the base and at the central part it is known as ovule so this is all about the parts of the flower now let us see some terms associated with the flower first of all complete or perfect flower complete flower is uh, that flower which contain all the parts of a flower that is calyx corolla androecium and gynecium it is present with the flower the flower is considered as a complete flower next is incomplete or imperfect flower if one or more part of a flower is missing this is considered as the imperfect or incomplete flower essential part of a flower in all four holes androecium and gynecium is considered as a essential part because it takes part directly in reproduction of the flower and uh, now non essential part calyx and corolla which supports the process of reproduction that is considered as non essential part and uh, next term is perianth when petal and sepal are not differentiated to each other they are considered as the perianth petaloid when perianth is non green this is considered as the perianth bracts when flower is leaf like like a structure this is known as bracts the next uh, term associated with flower is uh, nectaries all generally all flower produces sweet fragrance they are known known as nectaries so sweet fragrant liquid producing cell is known as nectaries hermaphrodite the flower 
having both stamen and carpels this is known as hermaphrodite polypetalous in polypetalous sepals are free all the sepals are free to each other then the flower is considered as polypetalous and gamopetalous in this case sepals are fused to each other as you can see in diagram all the sepals are free to each other so this is the case of polysepalous and in this second diagram the sepals are fused to each other so it is considered as gamosepalous now let us see the next term polypetalous if petals are free see the petals in this diagram all petals are free to each other so it is considered as the polypetalous next term is gamopetalous you can see the petals petals are combined they are fused to each other so we cannot uh, separate it uh, to each other then this is the case of gamosepalous next term is monodelephus in stamens if the stamens are united in one group this is considered as monodelephus with the case of didelephus the stamens united to two groups then this is the case of didelephus and uh, finally polydelephus stamens are united in several groups so my dear student this is all about the flower its part and terms associated with the flower for today this is all about the flower thank you